Got Daniel House on the line from GophersGuru.com. Please check out his work right there. It is first rate all the way. Uh, talk about unique. Chas Surratt's skill set. Uh, you know, it's one thing to say you can play linebacker and safety at the collegiate level at a Power 5 conference. It's another thing to say uh, you can switch over and play some quarterback. When we, You know, the guy was the starting quarterback at North Carolina at one point. That doesn't say a whole lot for North Carolina's uh, status as a program at that point but uh, switches over to defense and was clearly just a, a guy that just filled up the box score across the board making plays. Yeah, the biggest thing now was just getting that physical strength because he converted quarterback, played two years at linebacker, doesn't have a lot of size, only 229 right now, but runs a 4.5940, has the elite speed and range, You know, instincts, made a lot of plays. Like you said, high volume guy uh, at the linebacker position. That's something the Vikings have valued consistently now with Anthony Barr and the contract language that was modified. So he has a void year so he can void out of his contract and hit free agency. Vikings did that for financial reasons, needing to get someone off the books there. So it's Chaz Surratt, the guy that, you know, gets into the strength and conditioning program, learns the system this year and eventually emerges as a developmental guy to replace Anthony Barr. I mean, you look at the upside of his game has a lot of unique traits, but still the physical part of it concerns me because it's it, you know, it was something that showed up with him at the senior bowl too, you know, not being as physically ready to play against that top tier competition. Now you elevate up to the NFL. That's going to be the biggest hurdle for him is getting physically ready to play, but you cannot deny the traits. I mean, when you watched him at the senior bowl and the coverage drills, he was handling running backs and tight ends, easily one of the most impressive players in the coverage drills as a linebacker. So that's what the Vikings are valuing. You know, Eric Kendricks is one of the most rangy, instinctive, high volume linebackers in the NFL. You could argue he's one of the best linebackers in the NFL and pairing him up to mentor someone like Chaz Surratt. Vikings obviously felt like the upside was worth taking a chance on at that stage of the draft. 